Alright guys, this is a battle against uh, Ijarumo from YouTube, a good friend of mine. He has challenged me via MSN and I accepted his uh, invitation. So, I start with my glitch car like I always do. Um, so he leads over to my champ. I but I get some Steve Rakoff and he encore me. So I'm gonna force to switch out to the evil. Well, um, he is a bub, which is... Uh, really nice on his part cause I don't have any idea which set move uh, my champ has well I've seen three moves already in core uh, substitute and stun edge so the last one should be dynamic punch I'm pretty sure well he has stun edges and I went uh, for my empoleon I switch out to my empoleon and I was like uh, let's bring empoleon in field so I can take the stun edge coming but it was a really bad idea I uh, tried to surf and he dynamic punch so I know his whole move set to that now and yeah ice king has died and that's really too bad um, right now I'm gonna bring him back my uh, one to Drago which is a long time ago that I haven't used it anymore but right here I was uh, predicting like I, would, like I did before and yeah that was uh, really bad cause he didn't predict me so he stayed in. Well, I went back to my day evil to avoid the dynamic punch since he don't has ice punch, uh, which worked pretty well. And I shot a ball and finishes my champ off. Right here, I was expecting him to switch or to hypnosis or something instead of shot a ball. So that's why I stayed in. But that was a really bad choice uh, on my side. Uh, that was really bad that I stayed in, cost, cost me the life of the evil just like it did with uh, Ice King and Polion so it's really too bad well right here I was so freaking sure I would I should survive the shuttle ball so I should I should have gone for the subject but I didn't which really cost me the whole, entire match right here cause almost this whole team is weak fire um, alright I discharge expecting uh, yeah expecting him to switch actually but I wasn't really smart cause when he bring out his uh, Gengar back to the field he's gonna die because of uh, Steel Rock. Alright, right here a lot happens and I went for my one till Drago and I fire punch. He hypnosed twice and he has missed it. So it's really great. Well, I went for the fire punch again and he has uh, sacrificed his man Gengar which was a really smart set on his part. So he can bring uh, safely his Pokemon 26 to the field which is his Infernape. Well, since I know every single Infernape moveset, I'm pretty sure this one is the mixed one. Close combat, item power, ice, grass, grass nut, and what's uh, the other called? Oh yeah, flamethrower. I I'm pretty sure that that Pokemon has that moveset because everybody that uses all use is almost using the same thing every over and over and over again. So that really sucks, actually. That's really too bad. There is no more originality anymore. So that sucks. Well, I went for the Sky Uppercut since my uh, Select Berry has been activated, and that's good. He went, he expected that, and he went for the Sabdos. Well, I Blaze Kick. I could have sworn in, in that turn that he was too, but how did I knew? I, 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 I couldn't know that uh, before he did it. So that's really too bad. Yeah, my Blaze Kick is my, uh, yeah, my lovely Pokemon. He has just died. So that's that's so bad actually. Um, I outrage and I finish the Sabdos off, and I'm totally lost. I I know I'm gonna lose because, yeah, I always lose against that even if I I never have a uh, counter against it, and if I have one, I always lose it before before facing it against the uh, Infernape, So that's really too bad actually. Right here I went for my evolution too. I was pretty sure I should survive the CC close combat and I went for the discharge which is really great I have survived right so I discharge and I have killed this Infernape but if that happened earlier and I just got my blaze again back with the speed boost of select Barry I should have won this match this match but too bad right here I switch back to a Vampiro since I knew every Jirachi, I'm telling you, everybody is acting like an ape. They always copy themselves. They always do the same. And so I knew he would use uh, physical Jirachi.
I switched back to my uh, F F evolution to to think he would switch, but yeah, he didn't. So that's too bad. I sacrificed one of my Pokemon for nothing. That's really too bad. Right here is it's just Roost Iron Head Flinch Critical Hit. Roost Iron Head Critical Hit Flinch Flinch Critical Hit Iron Head Roost Iron Head and all this stuff. Sure, this is bad. Well, I won't say anything here. I guess I will stop narrating this video because this is annoying. I hate this. He gets a freaking flinch, or he gets a critical hit, or I just have to recover my HP and I try to attack, but I get flinched. So, that's fucked up. So, uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and I check you guys later, and of course, take care of yourself and have a good day.